This video is on electrophilic addition reaction, application of Markovnikov's rule. Propene reacts with HBr via an electrophilic addition reaction. HBr is a polar molecule with H being electron deficient. Hence, the electron deficient H is the electrophile. The pi electron pair is attracted to the electrophile. While the HBr bond's electron pair goes to the bromine, breaking the bond. Thus, the hydrogen being the electrophile can be added on this carbon. Alternatively, the electrophile can be added on the other carbon. Adding the electrophile on the carbon with two hydrogen gives carbocation A. While adding the electrophile on the carbon with one hydrogen gives carbocation B. Both carbocation A and B are reactive intermediates of the elementary step. But which is more likely to be formed? The stability of the carbocation depends on the number of alkyl substituents it has. Fact: Alkyl substituents are electron donating. This reduces the positive charge on the carbocation, making it less reactive. When the intermediate is less reactive, it is more stable. Hence, using this principle, we can compare carbocation A and B. Carbocation A has two alkyl substituents attached to the carbon with the charge. Carbocation B has one alkyl substituent attached to the carbon with the charge. Since alkyl substituents are electron donating, carbocation A is more stable than carbocation B. Hence, the electrophile adds on the carbon with two hydrogen to give carbocation A. This is in agreement with Markovnikov's rule. Bromide's lone pair of electron is attracted to the carbon, therefore forming two bromopropane. Replay the video if you need a repeat.